Welcome back everyone to another exciting episode of Let's Play Bug Fables, The Everlasting Sapling. I'm your host, Mr. Gazillion, and I was just about to reveal this game as being... Um... Crosscode. I'm all tired, I guess. Yes, in the last episode, um, we defeated... Uh, Venus. Yes, that's right. Venus, Venus, Venus. And, um... Venus was... Oh, we're Spud, yes. We needed a... We need some items, we need some berries. <laughs> because I am poor. And I knew those berries because my health... To my character's health is down to 1 HP, which is real bad. Real, real bad. So, to try and survive, we're gonna try and get to, I think I need nine. So hopefully that doesn't take us too long. I could take some money out of the bank, but that, that, that goes against everything. You know, we had, you know, we have a plan. We had a plan here uh, to accumulate interest. So if I go out taking money out of the bank to, uh, to pay for my hotel stays, well, we're never gonna make money. That, that stuff's our retirement money. That's just our retirement. So we gotta leave it in there. And hopefully we can basically... Just kill a bunch of these things. Then yeah, exactly. Get like berries here and there. Um... I don't think I can die, <laughs> like... Um... Maybe I can, but, but I don't think so. And I don't think we need to come here just yet. 300 berries is really expensive to cross the waters. So I'm guessing that this is actually going to be somewhere uh, we come to, uh, excuse me, later on. Or maybe it's actually a, um, oh, what's the word I'm looking for? Like endgame content? You know when they have secret bosses that are really tough? Maybe that's a secret land with really tough monsters that will kill us in one shot and they make you regret um, going through all this trouble. So yes, we're just gonna hit a few of these. You're, you guys are in for the ride. You know you want me. You watch me do stuff. Ex watch me do some exciting stuff like beat bosses. You watch me lose to bosses. I've actually lost a couple of fights now. Uh, this is actually the first game. Well, I'm playing on hard mode, I guess. But this is actually one of the first games in a while where I actually struggle on the, on the, uh, in the encounters. Uh, or, or I should specify um, turn-based RP. Because CrossCode, I definitely struggled, but I'm not good at games like CrossCode to begin with, so it was difficult. But games like turn-based games, very rare for me to lose. Um, in Octopath Traveler, I would lose every once in a while because um, I think I want to cross over here. I need a double jump, that's for sure. Uh, yeah, so in Octopath Traveler, I, I would die. I died a couple of times, but mostly to, um, to, uh, like, bosses I, that I wasn't supposed to go up to. But we're talking about stuff like, uh, the true final boss, which is impossible, by the way, and the fact that that boss lasts an hour, there was no way I was gonna go back and do that. Uh, there was also the secret or the special job classes. Those bosses at one point. Excuse me. I discovered them. I discovered those bosses and I, um, I was way too low level, so I got my butt kicked. But when it came to story-based bosses, never lost. Or at least I don't recall ever losing. Come on, I just need one more. One more berry. You guys are like, man. Oh wait, no, we can stay here for free. Can't we? Yeah, I think we can stay here for free. Yeah. Funny. We can get our health back for free. I actually had forgotten that we can do this, so there you go. So we don't actually need to waste the nine berries. There we go, everything's back to normal. <laughs> we have to go a little far to get the free in, which is unfortunate, but I guess... If you're really desperate, it's an option. That's kind of what we were. 
Excuse me, I really thought we were screwed because I was like, how can we possibly afford to stay at an inn and, uh... But I guess at this point we're killing most of the monsters just in one shot. I kind of still want, want that one berry, but I'm not going to work too hard towards it. Just hitting some of these things on the way back to do the trick. They are rare. They don't want you farming these berries. That's clear. Thing is, you don't really get berries from battles, do you? I don't think you get berries from battles. Do we? Find out, actually. We have eight berries right now. We have eight berries. So if I unequip bug me not. There you go. I got the advantage here. So I unequip bug me not. Two, three, go, boom. Um I don't want you to hit the middle guy. I wasn't expecting them to be to have three things to fight. I was kind of hoping to kill these things one turn. So we're gonna end up using some an, an ability here. I don't want to. What? Well, that's unfortunate. I'm actually gonna take damage here. One, two, three, go. Oh, he's not even dead. Gonna be dead here. Awesome. Nice. Awesome. Nice. One, two, three, go. I don't know why I made him fight that. And you go. Super, that's good, but not enough. We only do one damage, I'm pretty sure. No, we did two. Okay. So do we get berries here? Got one exploration point. Okay, you get you do get berries, so you can farm oh my god. I've been making this game a lot harder on myself. Uh by um insisting on just having the monsters die I get to oh my god oh my god okay we have to kill that that golden thing right now so you okay 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 uh ice fall or frigid coffin yeah that guy yeah we gotta one damage um, does he have any special pebble, heavy strike taunt? No. Um, how about you do that other one? I'm so bad at this hurricane toss thing. I ignore one defense while, okay, at this, hold it in its place, ignore one defense while damaging and flipping an enemy. Can we actually flip him? Or am I better doing this? I might be better doing this. I gotta press at the right time. I'm so bad. Oh, I'm so bad at it. What? Okay, turn, relay. The leaf. Can you do, do ice fall? Try and hit some of these guys, I guess. Okay, good. We hit that guy. How much health does he have? How much health does he have? I'm gonna do another turn. Oh no, I can't turn really infinitely. Okay, we're gonna need to do something else. I think I, I can do a pebble toss here on him. And it's zero. Awesome. He ran away. I used everything I had to try and kill this guy. <laughs> and it didn't work. How much health do they have? That's kind of frustrating. And that was definitely in the circle. One, two, three, go. Oh, man. Well, at this point, let's just use some magic. Uh, I thought that would hit all of them. Oops. Block? I wasn't paying attention. That was a horrible block. 
Um, let's actually make a leaf for this guy. There we go. Then V, you hit the one to make him land. There we go, at least now it actually lands. One, two, three, go. There we go, three. <laughs> yeah, I don't blame the... Oh, wait. We didn't get any money. Why not? I'm confused. Why did not why didn't we get any money this time? I guess it's random or maybe it's based on our performance cuz let me tell you that performance was atrocious. Well, I don't feel like spending money when I didn't get when I basically wasted all my resources in that last one. I'm not going to cut all the grass. I'm just going for the free. Sorry. I honestly thought I could farm a few berries, but clearly the game... Or maybe you get berries when we fight monsters get give you XP. So those ones then, but maybe like the mosquitoes and the other monsters in the other zones. Hmm. Interesting. Something to ponder. Something to wonder about. We know that some of these things are farmable, so at least there's that. Alright. Oh boy, yeah. Head to the queen, I guess. Get some story done in this episode. Uh, maybe if there's... Ah, no, no. I don't want to waste time. The queen's going to send us on her next errand. Uh, it's going to be to that other gate that was closed before. And now it's not going to be closed. I really don't understand why there was a puzzle there in the first place. I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about. It's like a bridge. To access that bridge, you need to hit the switch with V's new upgraded boomerang. But, um, even though you do that, even though you get that in, in the golden settlement, you can't do anything to get there because of the wall. So it's like, let me go. Or don't put the puzzle, you know? Because I wouldn't have gone back if it wasn't for the puzzle. I would have thought to myself, like, oh, we, you know, I would have went there once at the beginning, been like, oh, we can't go here till the game wants us to go here. But then when I got the ability, I was like, oh, dang, there's a puzzle. We can go now. There's probably some medals. Ah, oh, you're here. Come now, the queen's waiting for us. It's one thing to make the queen wait, but us as well. I'm sorry, I was going to the inn. I was trying to figure out if bugs could give us some stuff. Oh god, we really did make her wait for us. Hey, look at look at the amazing Bianca, Queen of the Bees. Oh, that's Bianca. I was gonna say that's probably Elizon the first. Is this Elizon the first? No, this is the second one. They both wore masks though. Oh, you've all come. I must say you're in time. I crowded those questions. We'll have to wait. Tell us without further ado, Team Snake Mouth. Have you found the artifact hidden in the Golden Hills? Yep, we're ready for that reward. Wonderful. This timing is simply impeccable. I must congratulate you for bringing this artifact to my care. This must be sign of even more good things to come for the Ant Kingdom of and Bulgaria. It was our honor, your highness. Dariant, please collect the artifact and hand them their rewards. As you command, my queen. You have earned this, Team Snakemouth. You got a crystal berry. You got 30 berries. <laughs> Thanks again. The bee, bee bank keeps filling. Oh, um, may I take a look as we discuss? Yes, make haste, Zariant. I don't with care, Professor. Oh, of course. Oh, yes, yes! My research held true. This tablet must contain information on how to find the everlasting sapling. What? 
but that's just a bunch of blue lines. Oh, Fee, that's where that mask you found in Snake Mouth comes in. It's really what a man. Uh, it really was a mask. I thought it was just a weird rock. Huh. <laughs> so I was right. Don't boast, Kaboom. Hey, listen now. The mask is an interpreter. Through it, these lines move into the roach alphabet. Who cares? I cannot tell how it actually works, but the roaches had such marvelous technology. I'm smitten. Wonderful. Very, very wonderful. And we are making progress in finding the sapling. Finally. Now, who's asking that? What do you need, need the everlasting sapling for? That is not for you to know. <laughs> Just know that with it, my mother's dreams will come true at last. Mazant's dream? Professor, how long will it take for you to decipher this tablet? Oh, um, it'll be some time. Even with a mask, the runes are still in road scripts. So sorry. I see. Fret not. That leaves us with time to retrieve the other artifact. There's another one? Mm-hmm. My research indicates there are three artifacts. And with the missing key, we can unlock the everlasting sapling. Then we're almost at the finish line. Yes, and given what we know, the key should be in the Bee Kingdom. Uh, really? Long ago, before knowing of its real nature, they used it when building the Honey Factory's core. But I'm not sure if they will give it to us, because taking out will shut down the whole thing. Uh, it'll shut down the factory? B -b but Do not worry. Both of you. We have sent our envoys to the Bee Kingdom ever since you told us about the key. Finally, they have agreed to let us take it in exchange for materials to build a replacement. That is wonderful. Oh, joy. Then it won't cause them any trouble. And so the job's trading these materials for the artifact? Precisely. That is your next mission. And luckily, a young bee joined your ranks recently. She will be of great help in this mission. Bee. Oh, right. These Team Stigmouth is on a roll, aren't they? It's all fair game, Celia. We have our own task to excel at. With that, you are all dismissed. Except Team Snake Mouth and Team Celia. I wish to have a word with you. Well, I guess we'll be going now. I wish not here. Now I've kept you here to ask about the wasp situation. The professor has mentioned you all helped him when he was attacked. For that, you have my gratitude. We're unworthy, your highness. We only did what any explorer ought to do. So cool. It was worrying, though. They seem to know about the artifacts somehow. And it is as I feared. We are running out of time. You must all remain on guard and avoid the northern border with the Wasp King Kingdom at all costs. As you wish, your highness. To reach the Bee Kingdom, you must travel southeast from the Association and take the first north exit. With my permission, explorers may now cross a passage to the Lost Sands. Be wary, however. The number of bandits in the Lost Sands has been increasing lately. Head straight to the defiant route as soon as possible to enter the Beehive. We will get it done, your highness. Uh -huh. Dismissed. Chapter 3, Factory Inspection. I think we all know how to get there. Right? That being said, we do have some things to take care of first. If you have time, perhaps you could check out the quest board in the plaza. Try not to clear the mission too quickly so we may catch up. No promises. Yeah, we're kind of side quest doers, so... Um... Yeah. We leave V. Uh, thank you. I'll stay here and do my part. I hope it'll be smooth sailing for you. Having V on your team must be big help. Uh, yeah, definitely. Oh, I didn't. I meant to jump. There you go. Head to the Bee Kingdom through the Lost Sands. The passage is on the east side of the Association. You three, stop bothering the Queen and go! Jeez, we just wanted a reward. I figure we've worked hard enough and 30 berries, well, we get that a lot faster. Fighting mobs and doing quests for Her Majesty. 
Huh. I've never been to the hive. This is a good opportunity. Uh-huh. V, are you okay? I know you're not on the best terms, but... Look, I don't want to talk about it right now, okay? Ah. Well, if you don't want to talk about it, there's something we want to discuss. What's up? Venus mentioned that our... Our team got away from Snake Mouth's death. Even the passage of time, they're most likely gone, but... We can't help but think. Maybe their children are around, do you follow? Oh, oh, that's right, your team can be around in spirit! Leaf, you'd like to go look for them. We're in the middle of a mission, so there's no rush. But if we ever find the time... Uh, no problem, we'll just find them as we go along. Indeed, we'll keep our eyes open. Thank you, that's all. Let's go on with it. get on with the mission. Uh, right, yeah, uh, let's go. Oh dear. Logbook updated. So there you go. That's a few more things. Not a lot, though. Would you like to save? Of course I'd like to save. I always love saving. Let's go check out these new, um... Um... Quests that I surely have unlocked. la de da Oh, look at him. Ah, uh, check it out. Now some new quests available for you. Uh, theater help wanted. Oh, the bug the bugamity. I finally found such a talented bee actress, but my ensemble cast fallen sick. Please want a team of at least three bugs. Help me savage this play from the clutches of disaster. I pay well. Well, sir, if you pay well, we'll accept. Gonna take that one? Yeah. All right, do your best. We'll take risks. Oh, this Le this is Levi the Explorer. Team Sealer humbly quest for another team's assistance on a most crucial mission. Meet us at the leftmost region of the Ant Kingdom's commercial area for more details. Gonna take this one as well. Oh, all right, do your best. Well, we're always gonna take quests uh, from friends. Good save. And I think I think we're gonna call it here. Um, in the next episode, we're going to uh, I don't know, let's do some of those side quests. I'm thinking we'll take on the theater quest number one. And then maybe, just maybe, uh, we'll um, go and help out our friend from Tillia. And while, oh look, Todd, Todd, come on, it's lunchtime. You, muse? Ah, oh, mom, can't I play a bit longer? Sweetie, you need to eat. I'll give you all the power you need to play all day. I made you your favorite, a tasty, hearty breakfast. Whoa, thanks, mom. Leaf, who's Muse? That's our wife. Her wife? But Leaf, that's... impossible. Then she's got to be your super mega granddaughter. That's right. Isn't it great you can meet up with your relatives? No, not at all. How can we face them like this? Lost to time, not even understanding ourselves. It can't be that bad. To them, we're just a stranger. If we're going to intrude on their life, we need to know the truth about what happened to them. It will help you, Leaf, every step of this journey. Ah, uh, yeah, and, and when you're ready, we can come back and meet them. Thanks. Let's keep an eye out for clues. Can't ignore our mission, though. Let's keep going. Well, we're glad to see them safe and happy. Well, there you go. That's a positive little thing. Can we go inside? Looks like there might be stuff we can buy. Uh, not yet. We're not ready to phase them. Very well. Let's come back once we learn what happened in Snake Mouth's Den. I wanted to go check it out. Looks like there might be money. Welcome. Oh, it's you. Uh, you have 77 berries. Thanks. Uh, let's add... 30... Let's do that for now. There you go. Yeah, they're safe here. All in your grubby little hands. You're kind of cheap on the interest there, Mr. Bug or Mrs. Bug or Mr. What's a bug banker? Bang, a bang, a bunk. I don't know. Don't ask me. I'm too tired. So yes, hopefully we'll make a little bit more money next time and. We'll do some of the quests and uh, help Team Celia, or is it Team, I forget what their name is, but it's okay. As always, I'm your host, Mr. Gazillion. Thank you so much for watching, liking, and subscribing. Uh, let me know what you think about Bug Fables, the Everlasting Sapling, and I'll see you all next time.
Bye.